Hey guys. Please subscribe my YouTube channel. Today I will tell you. History of, the Red Fort, located in Old Delhi, India. So move toward my today's video. The Red Fort, also known as Lal Kila, is a historic fort complex, located in the city of, Delhi, India. The fort was built in the mid-17th century, by Mughal Emperor Shah Jahan, and served as, the main residence of the Mughal emperors, until 1857. When the British took control, of the fort following the Indian Rebellion of, 1857. Today, the Red Fort is a popular tourist attraction, and a UNESCO World Heritage Site. Construction of the Red Fort, began in, 1638, and was completed in 1648. The fort was constructed, as a symbol of Mughal power, and was designed to be a grand residence, for the emperor, and his family. The fort covers an area of, over 250 acres, and is surrounded by a moat, and a 70-foot high, red sandstone wall. The architecture of the red fort, is a blend of, Persian, Timurid and Indian styles. The fort complex, comprises of several buildings, including, the Devant Aam, Devant A Kos, the Modi Mosque, the Shah Burj, and the Rang Mahal, among others. The Devant Aam, or the Hall of Public Audience, was used by the Emperor, to receive the general public. While the Devant A Kos, or the Hall of Private Audience, was used to receive important guests, and conduct official meetings. The Modi Mosque, or the Pearl Mosque, is a small mosque located, inside the fort complex. The mosque was built by, the Mughal Emperor Aurangzeb, in 1659, and is made entirely of white marble. The Shah Burj, also known as the Royal Tower, is a two-story octagonal tower, located inside the fort. The tower was used by, the Emperor to keep a watch, on the surroundings, and is believed, to have been the place, where the Emperor was kept, captive by his son Aurangzeb. The Rang Mahal, or the Palace of Colors, was the residence of the Emperor's wives, and mistresses. The palace, is known for its beautiful decorations and paintings, which include floral designs, and scenes from the life of the emperor. The palace also has a central pool, which was used by the women for swimming. The Red Fort, has witnessed several historical events, including, the coronation of, Emperor Bahadur Shah Zafar, in 1837, and the hoisting of, the Indian national flag, by Jawaharlal Nehru, the first Prime Minister of India, on August 15, 1947, when India gained independence, from British rule. The Red Fort, has undergone several changes, over the years. During the British rule, the fort was used as a military garrison. And several buildings were destroyed, or modified. After India gained independence, the fort was handed over to the, Indian government. Which undertook extensive restoration work, to preserve the fort's heritage. Today, the Red Fort, is a major tourist attraction. And a symbol of India's rich cultural heritage. The fort complex, is open to visitors from, Tuesday, to Sunday, and hosts several cultural events, and exhibitions throughout the year. The Red Fort, is also a popular venue for, the annual Independence Day celebrations, which include a flag hoisting ceremony, and cultural performances. If this video is helpful for you, then, like and share my video, and subscribe my YouTube channel.